Is your pond weedy? Is uh, plant overabundance an issue in the appearance of your pond? I like to follow what I call the 20% rule in most pond situations. If a pond is around about 20% covered or filled by an aquatic plant, that's generally considered optimal. That's going to provide a good amount of habitat for the fish and do what is necessary to prevent wave erosion along the shorelines. On the other hand, if your pond uh, plant abundance is getting far above 20% or headed in that direction, then you need to take some steps to consider a, a plan to reduce plant overabundance. It starts with bringing either a sample of the plant itself or some good close-up photos to your county extension office. Once we have the problem plant identified, in most cases we're going to try to match it up with an herbicide that fits both the plant and all the particulars of your pond situation and objectives. Go slow with using herbicides. Treat the pond in sections as uh, advised by your county agriculture educator. Beware of totally eliminating plants from a pond. When you do that, you're going to throw it out of balance. You're going to, uh, if you care about fishing, you are eliminating all of the habitat and a lot of the food sources for that fish population. Your fish will become skinny. And uh, you're opening up the shorelines to wave erosion and possibly uh, creating a situation with that uh, wave erosion that will create a muddy and, and ugly looking pond situation. So don't go too fast. Pond uh, plant overabundance is something that unfortunately most people overlook or put off until the next year. Watch out for that problem. Get after it right away and don't wait. Otherwise your pond will probably end up being more weeds than water.